All right. Checking how live I am. All right, gone live. Cool. All right then. Uh well, today what we're going to do is that we're going to just going to like finish Kirby's Dream Lane 3. And I think that's about all I'm going to do today. I'm just going to finish the rest that I didn't finish uh, Friday like I wanted to. So let me get right into it. Okay, good. For a second, I thought I couldn't hear noise for some reason, but we're just going to finish this game up because most of the stuff is new and then um i think i gotta leave early today because uh tonight i was gonna go watch a movie so just gonna be enjoying our time telling gooey to like get out of here and enjoy bean bird especially bean bird i think i'm almost done with the game i just want to say that i haven't done a lot of completionist stuff I don't blame you, Cat, once again. Yeah. I'm expecting to beat 4 and 5. If there's more, I'll be genuinely surprised. Oh. Already forgot the controls. Perfect. A is not jump, it's B. Okay. love the aesthetic of this place. This is my favorite type of cloud thing to see. I think it's also got, like, close to my favorite shade of pink. I really love pastel pinks, but... Yeah, I guess instead of me uh, being more experienced this time around, that is literally a part I've never gotten to. So I guess in a way it's cool that we got in a realm of new stuff now. Get fire for once. I'll get fire a chance. Man, this game is always so relaxing to come back and play. So I thought today, why not just make it about that? Because this usually just gets smaller segments, you know? I guess for anyone who doesn't know. Um, don't come towards me. I have a sick feeling there's something down here. Oh. Wow. I did it for once. I got the secret thing without even knowing it was there. I just had a sick sense. This game's really good though. I really love it so far. I'm gonna take. I obviously need Rick, honestly. So let's take them. I'm sorry, Ku. I love you, but the one that's not designed for this level is the one that needs to be here. Fire power-up's pretty good for Rick, though, to be completely honest, but I love this game and I can't wait to beat it, honestly, because I remember the boss fight in here being pretty cool. I unfortunately spoiled myself to a lot of Kirby bosses, but yeah. Ooh, um, I already lost my win requirement, but that's fine. I accidentally killed myself twice. <laughs> Can we... Really just opened that sense for me, I guess. Cause I can't swallow you guys. And, yeah, I don't think so. Oh gosh. I love how this session's going so far. This is amazing. But I'm just gonna get through it. You know, maybe I don't need all the love. Maybe I'll trigger a different ending type thing, but you know. 
relaxing playing Kirby is fun sometimes. I definitely really love pastel aesthetics. It's definitely most of the reason why I love this game other than it being Kirby, but... I can't believe I never played this before. Like, I've played a lot of Kirby games for any knowledge for people here. I've played Triple Deluxe, um... I played Plant Robobot. That was the one I was thinking about. Um, oh, well. <laughs> I guess I gotta reset this, but... Gosh. Actually, what are the other Kirby games I've played? I swear I've played a lot of them. Oh, I played Superstar. 100%. Yeah. Um, Squeak Squad. Mass Attack. I haven't played the any of the Wii ones. I didn't play Air Ride, but I really do love it. Oh, and Star Allies. Star Allies is a good game. But I guess at this... get back here. At this point, we have another chance to uh, give Hamster Girl Hamster Boy. I don't know what Cutter ability is with him, so I might try that, even though Fire was really good, to be honest. It feels so weird seeing people with arrows in here and playing something like the modern Kirby games and them having Archer and be like, oh yeah, obviously, I need to get Archer ability, try that one out. This one has like eight copy abilities. Kind of interesting going back to a simpler time, honestly. Yeah, this game's completely golden. I should definitely play more of the older Kirby games. But they have so much worth in them. If they have any other older ones, I might try them. Like, I haven't uh, played Return to Dreamland. I hear that's one of the best Kirby games, honestly. I've never played it. Yeah, hopefully this goes pretty fast, I'm not sure. We'll see what happens when I get around uh, 5.30 or something. 5.30 is the time I plan to try and be done with this game. Around then, but we'll see. Just playing it cool with Kirby. Because I did play... Um... Oh, that's right, I make Kirby a boomerang. It's actually really good. Especially for this stage, but I did do it a little later today because oh, that's fine. We don't need hamster girlfriend. Um, but I did it a little later today because I was having some tech issues. Just a little bit though. So I did do a little later, but not too much later. I do gotta say, out of uh, a lot of the series I play, I definitely love Kirby. It's like one of the reasons why I love platformers so much. It's just like it's got such good feels, and it's like kinda the theming I have around this channel. It's just like feel good content. Sort of fits me a little bit. Kirby in general is something that I've loved for years and something I've never really let go of because, like, the Kirby games are always cute and fun in their own ways. Even, like, despite, like, the dark lore stuff people like to talk about in Kirby, like, games just make you feel so good and why wouldn't you want to play a game that makes you feel that way, you know? Just like this level. I think this is one of my favorite levels. I'm sorry! I wanted to bring Rick! Maybe if I ever feel like doing a bonus episode of this, I'll, uh... See what happens if I get more hearts. I don't know if there's anything special that happens. I might look that up, but... I'm just enjoying strolling through this game for the first time. Oh, who's this buddy? I love him. Who are you? This seems weird. 
Oh, they're just little drawings. Okay. Strange. Are you gonna have to remember this and do it in reverse? Man, if the, the Kirby's are nothing else but just quality games by Sakurai. Oh, you have to time everything here. Oh, that's interesting. Friends, how do I get over to you? I'll have to remember who's where. Let me get bird guy, middle. Cause I love him. Why not just end the game with frickin' coup? I like the idea of this level, though. It's a cool concept. Gosh, those guys always look super creepy. Oh gosh, especially those ones. Oh, that's right, I can inhale them, they're not like, um, the Poppy Juniors. I like how Koo's just looks kind of done with everything, to be honest. He's just like such a charming bird. Oh jeez. Just barreling it through here. What is the store? Why are you here? Oh gosh, spiders. Okay, why are there spiders here? What if I don't want any of these? Gosh, how many are here? I'm going right here. No, right over here. I don't feel like I could fit through one-way spaces with pets. It's interesting. Oh, this is just the right door. What's this one do then? So obviously there's one more. It has to be something. Special if they're not showing it. Oh. Yeah, it's sure special, alright. Oh, that's weird. They're all jambled up, so they're not even in the right order. I don't know what happens when he sometimes doesn't throw a ball, but... I approve of these last two levels. I really like them. Ice? Love ice. I could die for ice. Oh gosh, that would be really good to have beans. Gosh, the feather duster. It just shows how much I like Koo. I just enjoy all of his power-ups. Except 
Ironically enough, except for this one, it's okay. It's not, oh. Not my favorite. Oh wow, fire with two is interesting. You know what? Yeah, I I haven't been using fire as much. I'll use it. It'll inevitably lead to my own doom, but that's fine. levels. I- oh! Oh, they're alive now! S some of them are alive. You can only- oh, you can only tell if they jiggle. Like, are you alive? Might have got the health, at least, to be honest. No, I lost Q. If I barrel through here, I could get through most of them. Alright. What 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 do you want? So they supposed to do a puzzle? Looks like one of those shape guys again. Wait, is this painter kid? Oh, it is! It's that one kid from Kistel Stars. Oh, that's one of the Kirby games I've always wanted to play the most. I've never been able to get an N64, though. Oh, yes. I get to see their ability in action. That's awesome. Seem like they're a mix of a bunch of mini bosses. That's adorable. I want, I want ice thing. Oh, who are you? What do you do? Oh gosh, I almost ran right into you. Okay, I cannot eat those, I can't eat those. Should be the last one if Kirby's roll of three. Oh, technically three four. Oh no. It's the sun and the moon. Oh, this is just a love letter to Crystal Shards. That's adorable. Ah, oh, damn, that was so close. I wonder what's gonna start me. Actually, it was on the boss level already. I'm gonna try and do this as default Kirby though. There's not many bosses I go through without power-ups, but I'll try for this one because this game doesn't have many. It's kind of fun to just experiment, to be honest, since there's less power-ups. Maybe at some point I'll have to break out Gooey, but not right now. Gooey's a detriment to my strategizing. I really like the concept of these painter bosses, though. I've always loved them. Bring cute little creations to life. Oh, 
Oh, I can just sit here like this. I don't even need to necessarily dodge them. That was some cool cheesing there. Doing a lot better this boss fight. It was fun though, oh my gosh. This reminds me of how much I love Kirby bosses because they can be so creative like this. They just make a tiny, a lot of tiny mini bosses into one boss. And there you go, you got yourself a Kirby boss. Ooh, now they're, oh, they're switching. They go on different planes, that's adorable. I wonder if I swallow one of the things, I get um, a certain power up. Nope, that's not the case. At least I can possibly kill Moon. Now I do for this guy though. Oh, this. There we go. Curb activated. Oh, one more boss. Oh my gosh, yes! My favorite boss, Cracko. Dude, I've always loved this boss. I don't know why. Oh, they have baby Krakos this time. Okay. This one's gonna take a couple tries. Oh wow, okay. I could probably do this. I'm gonna try and fire a power up actually though. I definitely want bird. So I'll go back to this pretty level again. I'll take cutter first though. Oh, the arrows can hit you if you step on them, that's cool. Oh, well, I just killed myself. You know what? That's fine. I get to have extra lives. It was on purpose. Man. Hope everyone is enjoying their night tonight. Whenever or not or like whenever they watch this. Later. And I know that a lot of my uh streams here are going to be a little more delayed on the YouTube side, uh because of finding out editing and stuff like that to be honest. But I am going to try and get all this up, especially when all the Kirby's done, because that means I'll have all the Kirby series when I'm up to date. Be able to just watch that whenever. Now we can just get kill. And completely exit out of the level, because I think I'll have everything. Yeah, there we go. I won't need a ton of mobility during this, but I do just like using Q just because. Hard enough. 
Gosh, this is the easiest one to use with power-ups, jeez. But I guess these are supposed to be little fights anyways. Cracker's gonna be for this, because I imagine he's not gonna be as much as a cakewalk as everyone else. Is there any more? No, not the little kid! Oh no, this is so sad! He only has one health! No! <laughs> that was the saddest Kirby death! That's the last thing I expected was Drossia to just come for me. Wow. That was pretty spectacular. I love that boss fight. Snowman and oh oh gosh, it's a gooey snowman. I don't like this. Oh, this is great. I love it. Do not want wind right now. That's not real, is it? I was get these characters because some of them could just be like normal stuff. I'm like. Oh, did I thought that rock just yeeted itself? Oh, it just smashed down really big. Okay. Jesus, so many rocks and spiders here and everything. My goodness. Ah, oh, gosh damn it. Well, gotta go through this without coup, I guess. Which is fine. I just don't want to go rock because it doesn't work well at this level. I mean, the rock enemies are good here, but... Not as me. So I would just be sliding off everywhere if I'm to be completely honest. Fire's the right thing, I get to unfreeze the flowers. That's cute, I wanna do that. I'll make somebody happy. Like I said, it'll make somebody happy. Oh no, I accidentally missed the hidden room. That's okay. But since I probably missed stuff, I'm just going to go ice now. I definitely like ice in the later games because of how much they flesh out abilities in, in the other games, but, you know, I still respect their freeze here. 
Still my favorite power up in all of Kirby. Weird to say. But I know a lot of people don't like Freeze. But, you know. I don't know. I like ice. I guess that's all I really need. Don't need some complex reason for why I like a power up in Kirby, I guess. Ooh, this blizzard area. Oh, they have the little tumbling guys. That's adorable. Can't freeze them properly, though. Oh, no. Those bats are my worst enemies in the entire game. There's the end. I I almost saved all your children. I crushed one, but I was really close. People saw it. Maybe. Or you can call me stupid. I don't care. I don't care either way. Metroids? What? Hold up, Gooey. What the hell's going on here? Why? But why Metroid? What's going on here? I was unaware. Oh gosh, an earthquake's happening. What the heck's happening? Is this supposed to happen? I feel like there's a glitch. Nope! That, that's an avalanche. Don't want that. Do not want an avalanche. I don't like this. That's one of the things that I've always didn't like about snow. I got caught in a really bad white storm, or whiteout once. This basically explains my irrational fears of the whiteouts. Oh no, what do we do? It's coming so close. Jeez. Oh, now we're in a volcano. Okay. This level's going places. I didn't expect it to. Buddies. <gasps> Best buddy. I love him. I just got him. So, oh wait, no, they'll. I got bit out of level. I forgot about that. I'm gonna have to go through the avalanche again. Oh, you know what? There might be a six level because there's a there's a black star in the middle. I just realized that. You know what? Why don't you help me here, Gilly? There's nothing that I want right here. Gonna speed through this part. Gooey in tow. Can we help me? Oh, I can use Gooey to destroy things. What? Why are you going down there, Gooey? What did you have to gain? Yeah. Get him, Gooey. I believe in you. You're in my favorite stage. You're my favorite kind of stage. Oh! He just walked into the blizzard. Gooey! No, Gooey, what are you doing? Apparently, Gooey just doesn't care. Which is fair enough, Gooey. What's that avalanche thing, though? Do not want to be there. Gooey, get him. Do it, Gooey. 
Not that gooey. No, gooey, please. What are you doing, gooey? You, you know what? You took care of it. Now you die. Um, do I kill the Metroids? Okay, I killed them. I'm sure Metroid Mom won't be mad. She'll be fine. Oh gosh. They don't hurt me. You know what? Might as well go all out. See what happens when I terminate them. Maybe Samus will come and personally thank me. That's probably what will happen. At least they don't kill me. That's fine. You see, it did something. Okay, good. It wasn't like... Well, I guess this game is made on the NES. I was thinking about the the game because I know there's a certain game where Samus is basically a mother to a Metroid. I just remember really liking that plot line. Now this freaking bat comes in here and ruins everything. Did I kill all the Metroids? Do I have to re-kill them all? No. Okay, cool. I'm fine with this. I killed all the Metroids, so that's good. That was seeing them any so I'm assuming we're going to the sea. Oh no, it's him. That was a tactic to maximize all my health stuff. Oh gosh, there's a fake door under that real door. That's not legal, is it? Oh no, oh no, I need to get out of here. I can't, I can't go ice. Oh gosh. This is the most anxious a Kirby level has made me. I don't like having my view obstructed like this. Hi, S oh it is Samus! Hi! Oh, are some of the characters in here references to other games? Oh, that's adorable. Wow. I never realized this game was sort of one big... Had some, like, references in it. Even though I know some Kirby games do. That's cute. <gasps> Chef boy! Fine, Gooey, you come. Let's eat. There's a chef boy. We're on an ice level. Very much like. Just let me be freezy, that's all I ask for. Oh, jeez. That's just an invincible snowball. You take him, Gooey. Y'all be friends. Is this just a level or like. No, this has to be where I get my friends. No. Of course. Of course. How could I go without Bean Boy?
good. He just kind of makes everything longer range. That's like his thing, basically, I guess. I think about it. Longer range and I get bird to ride on, which makes me very happy. Until I die, but. Okay, I'm going back to get him. You know, it might be better to go with Q. Q has a really interesting projectile and I don't fall when I use him, which is the reason I like Umbrella. about ice is that if you go fast enough you can literally just barrel through everything too. Let's go through here now. What is down here? Oh water. Oh no, that was scrolling now. Oh gosh, I do not want to get hit by anything else. I need to get going, I can't keep ice anymore. Game says no. This is getting a little hard here. I know Kirby games can get a tiny bit hard, but I did not expect that today. Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna have to restart this all over again. Don't worry, I'm a pro gamer. This is really fun though. I do like this so far. They did seem to be doing better with uh, my boy though. So I should get them again. Cool. Oh wait, what about... What does Kitty have with ice? I'll see how fun theirs is. Oh... Oh... You know what? I'm gonna try that. That's gonna be a lot of mobility. like rocket that's so cool oh no damn that's actually a little hard to use even compared to Ku. yeah i think i'm gonna take Ku again that's fun though i like that no you, you know what i'm gonna use them it's fun so i should use it here we go good fat cat let's go helps me control stuff under water honestly
makes really good use for fast ice power up. I like that. I think I like mobility and how fast an ability comes out sometimes. How much I like it. Because I'm jiving with this. Why did I say that it shouldn't die? I seem to barrel through this. Don't care. Don't care. Gosh, why do they make it so hard to use cutter or like power ups underwater? Ice again. Perfect. What is down here for us? I still like cat better, especially when you spit me out like that fish. I still love you though. I would say I really enjoyed playing you this run. I got to experience you a lot more than I did the last one. Oh, we're playing games of Chef Boy. Oh, oh, this just shows the mechanic, I guess? Oh, it's the noise. That's totally what it is. Yay, Chef Happy, I love him. Good boy. Oh, ten. thing about this character is that they get a weird triple jump. I see double jumps a lot, but not triple jumps. I guess it's because they don't add anything extra usually. Now we have this guy as our friend, making up for the last time to get hit heart. I love Chef Kuzawa. He's always been cool. Ooh, we got a Maximator though. That's exactly what we needed. Honestly, more than one up. to next. Oh, another little friend. Gosh, I love ice worlds. I just don't know why. They're just ice is so mystical. I know how much I've talked about it on streams before, but ice, ice and plants do a lot for me. 
or birds. Gotta be patient for them, really. Oh gosh, I comboed him into myself. That was amazing. Just stay calm. I'm not doing any harm to you guys. You guys seem to be cool with us. Okay. We have to wait for them to go down now. Oh, I don't know how I didn't get hurt by that. But I'm cool with that. I like today being more of a quiet one, but I definitely feel better than last time. Last time... I just had... oh gosh. Some weird issues going on last time, so I'm glad to be playing this more this time. I might not get as much as I want to get done in this one because I definitely wanted to get through all of it, but now looking at it, really, like, I feel like this is going to take much longer than I anticipated. But I thought it was just going to be five worlds. Looks like it's going to... I mean, I just thought it... Yeah, I thought it was going to be five worlds, but it looks like six now. Definitely don't regret playing this game though. Super fun. Oh no. Ow. Um. door here, okay. Oh, that was just death. They're just like, you need to take fire. Well, I got the hint. Got it, fire. <laughs> we have to get fire or we're dead. At least it was kind enough to be like, this is your last chance you can get fire, even though we showed it to you a bunch. How do we get through this? What? Oh, so we need to get Q. Okay. Interesting. I never had them force us to take character. Wait, what? Wait, how are you supposed to do this? What? have over on the right door then. Wait, 
What? You're a snail. What? Oh, okay, mini boss. That's right. Oh, you're such a weird, interesting boss. I didn't get to do that puzzle then. That saga's over. deal with these tiki heads. What are they going to do for me? <gasps> Umbrella! Umbrella though. I love this power up so freaking much. I'm sorry I didn't find your shell. I didn't know how to get it. That was interesting, though. Yay, maximum tomato. I'm sorry to figure this out. How to get his jump path to go somewhere. The last two I did on purpose. Oh, we're in an airplane now? Gooey, get out of here. Get out of here, Gooey. Fine. Stay, Gooey. I have umbrella anyways. The one power up I want, anyways. Roll is the best power up, anyways. Even fully blocked projectile. Well, that's awesome. I always forgot about that. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you, Gooey. Here. What do you get, Rick? Let's, let's do that because I really like that animation. Plus, it looks like it makes me invincible. Gosh, nope, this is my favorite power up in the game now. I did not know about Rick having this kind of power. No, 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 no. I will gladly take this much damage. Uh, hold up, we should just. better. The world's a better place now. No more boss. Me and Gooey are both at one health. This doesn't look good for us. I should running over all these power-ups. Yeah, thank you, Gooey. I don't want to deal with all these elements. Oh! Wait, no. Gooey! That's my power-up! No, you know what? I should have never th said you're okay, Gooey. That's absolutely rude of you. How dare you. Gooey's evil. Oh wait, that looks like secret town down there. That block's taking a long time to get back up. No, this is a death pit. 
close enough. I would like to think I just have bird face during this entire thing. Oh my gosh. I did not know I could do this with him. That's one of the only parts I haven't seen then. But it's fine, because we're not going to see it anymore. Apparently. Oh gosh, I should just do like one more game over. Since I'm about an hour in now. And I'm a little bit above last time. We could like end before the boss or on the boss or something. Get, get out of here. squad again, because Rick and Umbrella is my new favorite power-up. Doesn't make you invincible, but that's okay. Still looks adorable. Yeah, we're sticking it here this time. Because Rick's pretty fast, so we can get past these puzzles pretty well. Just kill them like that if they do it good enough. How far back does this put me? Right here? Okay. I'm just gonna fly past this then. Don't follow me. I don't like your kind. as well. Well, it's fine. Oh, ice. No, they're all gone. No trace. Nobody can tell them that there's a Kirby, Kirby robbery going on here. You know what? I'll give you a chance. I feel like you're gonna do something here. <gasps> Good boy! I wish you could fit down here though, but I need this one up. I've been having a hard time with this Kirby game. This Kirby game definitely ain't easy for me, to say the very least. Maybe it is easy, but I'm having a little bit of a time with this. Oh, 
now we have electric here. Gosh, they keep showing us all the power-ups, like something's gonna happen. Oh gosh. Did it want us to keep ice that entire time? It did! Yes. What's up, pseudo gooey? Die, do you? All oh, right, we got three lives though. That's pretty nice. Guess we could have gone the other way too, but oh, Kirby, what are you doing here? Why? Why do you exist? Who are you? So why are you here? Huh. Uh, you know what? Fish gang. We're going with fish. It also makes us impenetrable. I like that. Honestly, fish pretty good. Especially the ice, oh my gosh. It takes a lot of lag time, like rocks sometimes, but generally pretty fun move set, all things considered. Dealing with sharks. Not a fan. Or kappas. I just like how this power up with the fish is no, I'm not dealing with you, power up. Oh! Who are you? Why are you in the wall? I don't like them. They look cute though, they look adorable. Slime cannons. Adorable. I have to kill the spores, I guess. Don't know why. Why are they everywhere? What are you? I wonder if they're like, have anything to do with dark matter. Oh no, you wanted a cat friend. I don't even remember seeing a cat in this level. Interesting. Let's beat the final boss. Unless this level gives me too much trouble. It's either this or the next one is. Ooh, this music though. Good. has dealt me a great hand. Oh, fate has dealt me an amazing hand, yes. I keep going middle. Sorry, you're not... Ooh. Ow. Can I still go through you? Sounds like... Meta Knight's, um... Castle. Oh, I needed um, electric. Okay, that's fine. But that one's easy to remember, at least. If... Whoa! Oh, you're from here. I always thought you're from a different game. Can I just? No, I can't leave. That'd be hilarious if I could, though. 
would absolutely love it. Gosh, the way his character design reminds me of, um... This one character from Cave Story. I haven't played a lot of Cave Story, but I do know I kind of like it. Might as well give up on the mission. Oh, this is just a boss rush. Whoa, he spins like a top? Whoa. One more boss left, maybe? I feel like there should be. At least I can get this feather thing, I guess. Let's just say at least we got one. We tried our best. Thought there were Ku's lost feathers. No, oh, I gotta get past here. If anything, I have. Wait, why can't I go down here? Okay, this has got to stop. I'm going to die. There we go. Whoa, how are you supposed to have spike here? What? Oh no, that's cutter. Oh, oh my gosh, I love this cute little boss. I'm, I'm fine, I don't think I need wind with Ku. I don't need a feather duster. I do need health though, that's mainly what I need. Oh, it's the first boss, fire! I think the first, maybe the second. Just relaxing here, enjoying ourselves today on our Wednesday. Hope everyone's enjoying the day. Ah, oh, this is the first bo mini boss, I think. Yeah, this seems oddly familiar. Are they stuck in the sky or. No, it's just. I think they're just floating. need to squish the bird in here. Well, I'm sorry you don't have your feathers, girl. Yay, got that one. Okay, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna try the boss. Wouldn't hurt. <gasps> it's King DDD. What's wrong with King DD? Oh, what's happening? Have I... Um... Have I not seen the final boss of this game or something? Oh, I definitely have not. Oh gosh, I would have remembered poor King DD! Oh, is that dark matter in him? Oh, gosh. That's crazy. I, I want you to get well, dude. No. Oh, take a break or something. Get better, you're a lovable character.
Seems a little weird. Are you okay? You can't eat he just dead? Oh, wait, that's the game? Oh! here that boy thinks he knows what he's doing here what are you even doing Kui? I can't move doing this but wow this is the end of the game this game definitely had a lot of content when I thought I saw another world that's why I was confused because this game at least for a Kirby game in my opinion it has a lot of content already other than Superstar, but man, this game is packed. This is definitely one of my favorite Kirby games. It's absolutely one of the Kirby games. I want to share the most with people because I feel like not many people hear about this one or Crystal Shards or anything, but I love all this one little one. Ah, oh, Squishy. That's the name of the squids. I can be learning all the names here. Even if we're never going to see a Doggin or a Bolton or anything like that. A lot of these enemies are lost time, but they're really classic. Especially with this type of pixel art. Man, I love pixel art. Maybe that's why games like these speak to me. I really love 16-bit or 32-bit games. So beautiful to me. <laughs> Look at that little guy, he's so happy, he rolled around. Oh, good. Well, this is a great game. I feel bad for King DD though. What happened to him? Definitely ate something not good, maybe. You know, I'll look up if there's any extra stuff and we could get back to this game for another day, but I will take a break for this game. Since I guess I got the normal ending, I would guess. Oh, the name is Bottomon. Don't know what that means all the other characters in here. <laughs> yeah, I like how Gooey's just along for the ride. Isn't this the first game Gooey's in? He's just sort of like, all right, I'm here, hi. You're my friend, Kirby. In reality, he's like, according to Kirby Star Ally, is like a manifestation of, flat, of dark matter. Like he's one of the dark matters. No, he's just a friendly guy who wants to also eat stuff. Oh, and? King DD? Oh, yeah! Nothing mysterious here, just dark matter! What's going on here? Do I get any more worlds? I think I would have to get all the friendly stuff, but you know what? I'm going to end it here, and we can get true dark matter some other day. I could look up a guide so I know how to get all the hearts in these properly if I feel like getting back to this someday. But I really enjoyed this playthrough, but I have seen that final boss. I thought that was the real final boss, but apparently that was King DD. Interesting. Well, I really enjoy this. I feel bad for King DD, but I hope he gets his stomach checked out. That's really weird. But I hope everyone enjoys their night and enjoys seeing a little bit of curb. I'm not sure how much lighter I'm in the game. Maybe I should turn that down in the future. But you guys have a wonderful night, and I'll see you Friday, I guess.